news break. Brought to you by National Mutual. Good evening. Former Pools promoter Harry Beitzel was today the target of a savage attack by Steve Crabb. The police minister told Parliament he'd do everything he could to make sure Beitzel faced the courts over claims he'd helped defraud Pools winners. The death toll from those storms that have devastated the southern states of America is now 24. A school in New York State took the full force of one tornado. Seven children died when a twister slammed into their school canteen. Residents of Ballarat are cleaning up after a freak hailstorm pounded the city, leaving a damages bill in the millions. And in Sydney a short time ago, a storm that lasted less than 15 minutes dumped nearly 10 millimetres of rain in the city, at one stage cutting visibility to zero. Winds of up to 80 kilometres an hour caused havoc at Bankstown Airport and ripped roofs from several buildings. There's outrage in El Salvador over the brutal murder of eight people, including six Jesuit priests. The outrage has spread to Melbourne, where a demonstration over the slayings is going on in the city square. Looking at tomorrow's weather, becoming fine and a top temperature of 18 degrees, that's after a low overnight of 13.